Have you ever tried to take out your drone to take an amazing shot of a place but realized that it wasn't legal or the space was too tight? Flying a drone comes with a lot of challenges. You need to get permissions and follow regulations, especially if you're trying to fly in urban areas or national parks, for example. And even if you get to sneak the drone into these places, it's not silent at all. So today I'm gonna show you how you can fake drone shots with your phone and a free app called Luma AI. Luma is a revolutionary app that lets you capture any 3D environment and turn it into a 3D scene that you can then manipulate any way you want. If you want a full breakdown step by step of how Luma AI works, definitely check out my other video. Today you'll learn how to capture the scene with your phone, how to edit it using the web app or my favorite tool, the AR feature in your phone. So if you're ready to turn your camera into a drone, let's dive in. To use Luma AI, you need to capture the scene with your phone. There are multiple capture modes that you can choose from, but for this video, we're going to use the freeform mode. The freeform mode is optimized for scenes, which means that lets you capture your environment without having to rotate around a single object. In this case, I'm capturing this park, which doesn't have a circular shape at all. To capture the scene, you need to move your phone around it in a smooth and steady motion. Try to cover as much of the scene as possible from different angles. The more angles you capture, the better the 3D model will be. Once you finish capturing the scene with your phone, just click upload and it will start processing. The first way to create the animation is in the web app. Here, you can access the camera editor and adjust settings for the scene, such as the resolution, camera angles, and keyframes. For example, I want to create a motion throughout the park that starts here at the beginning and orbits around. It's easy to move the camera around with the mouse, but if you want specific values, the camera path editor lets you control the position, orientation, and speed of the camera. Once you're happy, you can preview your moves. Keep in mind that this will be draft quality until the moment that you decide to export. Once you're happy with the video, you can export it as an MP4 file that you can share anywhere. Alternatively, and this is my favorite part, you can use the AR features to record the video directly in your phone. The AR feature lets you view your 3D model in augmented reality, or you can place it in your real environment and use your phone as a camera control. First, make sure you place and scale the scene to your liking, where it's comfortable to move around. You can also use gestures to zoom in or tap it to move it around. Then tap the record button at the bottom of the screen to start recording the camera back. Move your phone around your 3D model to create your desired motion. Then you can review your recording and smooth out the path. You can export your recording as an MP4 that can be saved directly in your phone and shared wherever you want. And that's how you can use Bluma AI to turn your phone into a drone. As you can see, Luma AI is a powerful and easy to use app that lets you capture 3D scenes and recreate amazing shots. I hope you enjoyed this video and learned something new. If you did, give it a thumbs up and let me know what type of videos would you like to make with Luma AI. Also, make sure to subscribe for more tutorials on video production and marketing. See you next time.